It's a neat story. It's trending this morning, too. Two pups get some help. They were stuck in an underground pipe, so police and firefighters came to their rescue. Well, joining us on the phone this morning is Officer Brooke DeShane with the Boxford, Massachusetts Police Department. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Thanks for having me. Well, we're doing great. And uh, tell us a little bit about uh, this call and uh, what you came upon once you guys got there. Sure. Well, Basically, the call came in around 1030. Um, it originally came in as one dog stuck in a drainage pipe. Um, upon arrival, we realized there was actually two dogs stuck in the pipe. Um, Mom actually saw the dogs go in. She thinks they were chasing a small animal of some sort. And about almost all the way through, um, they both got stuck. Um, it, the dogs were Rosie and Winston. Rosie's a, an eight-year-old German Shepherd mix who's about 60 pounds, and um, Winston is 10-month-old Jack Russell Terrier, who's about 15 pounds. And so basically, they got, the, the, the drain is located it's about 10 to 12 feet underground, and it's 177 feet long. Wow. And one opening is on the interior of their fenced-in backyard, and the other opening was on the exterior, kind of near their property line. And so there was a perforated uh, French drain pipe that was through the the um, one end of the pipe that when they went through, um, Rosie unfortunately couldn't get by that French drain. And we actually realized that Winston was never really stuck. Winston, the smaller of the two dogs, um, would not leave Rosie's side. Uh. They're best friends. <laughs> yeah, they, they're, they, I guess they're thick as thieves. They, they play together all day and they're never apart. And Unfortunately, when Rosie got stuck, um, Winston would not leave her side. So that was <laughs> that was an amazing thing. Um, we ended up we ended up sticking a camera through one end of the pipe. We were able to get a visual on the two on excuse me Rosie, but we never saw Winston. Um, Rosie was barking the whole time, and we never heard Rosie. So we were pretty worried that something was going on with Rosie. Um, and that's when we realized she couldn't get by that drain pipe. So we actually stuck a treat to the camera and fed it up to her, <laughs> trying to lure her out. Um, unfortunately, like I said, she couldn't get by that small six-inch window. So we, we let her have a little snack and uh, realized that, you know, we we're going to have to go to Plan B. And I'd like to point out this was an absolute t team effort. Um, we had several departments there helping us. We had Boxford DPW as well as Georgetown Highway Department and Boxford Fire. Um, Georgetown is our neighboring town, and we have a great relationship with them, and they're mm -hmm. absolutely lending, willing to lend a hand and, you know, willing to do anything they could to help us get the dogs out. So when we decided we were going to have to go to Plan B, they had brought over an ex excavator, and um, they started digging. We, we used some tools to kind of get an approximate, approximate location of where the dogs were, which is about 77 feet into the pipe, um, about midway point. So when we started digging, we realized uh, someone turned around and saw Winston on the, ins on the inside of the fence kind of just looking at us, waiting to get Rosie out, and we realized she was never stuck. Uh, Winston was never stuck. So we put her inside, went back to tending to Rosie, um, and at that point they were able to get down to the pipe and cut a square hole into the pipe and feed the camera through that end and realized that she had kind of wiggled herself uphill um, and that was a plus to us so we kept kind of poking towards her and she was able to wiggle herself to the original entrance way and at that point um, I think it was one of the DPW wor workers in Boxford grabbed her tail and pulled her right out and it was oh. a pretty amazing thing to see them yeah. start playing with each other. And, and playing. <laughs> Great yes, work. Absolutely. Great work. Love it. <laughs> It Love was a team ending. effort, absolute team effort. Yeah, well, thank you so much. Oh, thank you. Thanks for, thanks for calling. I really appreciate it. It's just a great story. I think there's so much tragedy in the news, yep. and I think this probably brought a smile to people's faces. I love so it. That's us. great. Yeah, we're sure. smiling, that's for sure. Thank you so much, that's Brooke. Great. Nice work. Yeah. Take care. Up.